Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Joey N. Jared. 175th box break. It is currently 1127 Eastern Standard Time here in Ottawa while I'm watching a tied Calgary BC game, 2121. There's your date and time for your own reference. Bear with me, please. We do this on two cameras in case YouTube cuts out. And there you go, it's refreshed. Jared will keep the camera there and then show you the list of winners for tonight. You'll be looking in the first column this time. There you go. Welcome to a few new people that we have and thank you for our return customers. Here's the in Calgary's got a touchdown. Here's the list on the secondary camera. Got a nice card right here from last night. I'm going to talk about that a little bit later in the break. And your serial number. The last thing you need to know to know this break is being done for you is right there, 732. No, I think so. No, well, it wasn't. Too perfect, but you can see it's at thirty-two. Okay, we'll stop arguing on the video now. Let's get to your break. Thank you, Jara. No arguing during a box break. At the end of this video, I'm going to talk a little bit about why we do the serial numbers and the list of winners. So, if you heard it on the last video, feel free at the end to shut the video off so you don't have to hear it again. Last night was the first box of this we opened. I really like these select cards. I know there's a lot of people out there still trying to get a couple cards for their favorite players. Lots of inserts that made it fun to collect. All right. First up, we have a Jean Gabriel Page oh, sorry. Jean Gabriel Pajot rookie card for the Ottawa Senators. Next up, we have a Youth Explosion, Boston Bruins, Otto, Colby Cohen. We have a rookie of Cameron Schilling for the Washington Capitals. We have a Stan Makita Parallel, Chicago Blackhawks. We have a double strike for the Detroit Red Wings, Nicholas Cronwell. And a rookie of Chad Rudewell, sorry if I butchered that name, Buffalo Sabres. We have numbered 98 of 199, Jersey Auto, Danny DeKaiser. Detroit Red Wings. And 
nice hit for Detroit. And that didn't take long. Calgary's back to winning. We have a fire on ice. Excuse me. Tom Wilson. Washington Capitals again. Yeah, me too. And Colin Wilson, Nashville Predators rookie. Or, sorry, not rookie. Uh, base parallel. Max Reinhardt, Calgary Flames, rookie auto, number two, 270 of 399. It's a regular one, right? Yeah. yeah We have a Victor Hedman, Tampa Bay Lightning base parallel. It'd be nice to do a base parallel of these two. A base parallel set. Yeah. For the Montreal Canadiens, newly appointed captain, Max Pacioretty Cornerstones. I believe these aren't numbered. And a rookie of Anders Lee, New York Islanders. We have, for the Florida Panthers, it's a different looking card, select signatures. Scott Timmons. Hmm. I haven't seen one of these. It's pretty nice. I like that. I like that play that. Yeah, it's very fun. And last pack. Good luck. Touchdown Calgary. Here we have a Eric Carlson, Ottawa Senators fire on ice. and a Ryan Miller base parallel. Alright, so that concludes the break. I just want to talk for a minute about serial numbers and lists of winners, date and time, etc. So if you've already heard me say this tonight on the last video, feel free just to turn the video off right now and let me congratulate you if you got hits and apologize if you didn't. Um, guys, a really long story short, is when you're buying it on box breaks, in case you don't know, if the serial numbers aren't being listed in the description of the break, chances are you're, you're, you're getting ripped off. Because all you'd have to do if you weren't listing serial numbers is shut the video off and then start a new video and open another box. This is a card you generally won't see from a seller who doesn't list serial numbers. We pulled this last night and pretty nice card from Select. Jared's telling me to show the other one too. It's a nice Martin Broder jersey auto at a 25. Yeah, sure, Jared. She's telling me to show the other one as well. This is the other one we pulled last night. So when a seller doesn't list serial numbers, the only reason they do that is so if they pull a card like this, which is probably about a $500 card, it was sold for about two bucks. Congratulations again. Um, all they'd have to do is shut the camera off, grab a new box, and start a new video, and keep this card for themselves. Guys, ask your sellers to either list the serial numbers in the description, not on their eBay page, and speaking about one seller specifically, or don't do breaks with them. There's plenty of us out there who are working hard um, for your loyalty, and I just, I hate to see you getting ripped off, losing money, and... Um, it just it ruins the hobby as far as I'm concerned. That being said, Calgary is now running away with this game with six minutes left. Thank you for everybody who joined the break. The ultimate case break is ending in three days. And that is under a different username, but that will be Joey and Jarrah's breaks as usual. And uh, have a great night. We'll see you next time. Thanks, guys.